Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So yes, it's that time again. Time to take up another champion. This one's gonna be a six star. And if you think you can guess who I'm about to take up, leave a comment below and let me know what you think. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Guardian. Yes, Guardian. Now, if you knew who I was about to take up, you are awesome. Because I didn't know that I was gonna be taking up Guardian during this level up. There's a tech advancement going on and I decided to take up my Guardian as a six star to rank two. Now, I believe he's a uh, SIG 40. I have a five star at rank five, SIG 200. Guardian, I feel is kind of underrated. He is pretty awesome. And he's nice to have even on the team, even if you're not planning on using him. And I'll, I'll mention that uh, a little bit later in the video. But I decided to take him up. Ideally, you want him at max SIG. The higher his SIG, the better. I believe the sweet spot is around 60 or so. So if in one of my future openings, I dupe him one more time, we're good, okay? And I might take him to rank three if I can dupe him maybe once or twice more. But he's actually really, really good. Uh, you don't see me use him a lot because I have other champions that I use. Um, you know, I have my favorite champions that uh, I can use in most situations, but he's actually legit. You know, he doesn't crit. He's got some high resistances. He can uh, uh, perfect block, uh, specials even. So you guys should look into him. If you haven't looked into him before, uh, I would suggest that you look into him. Uh, he, he has uh, quite a bit of utility. Now, coming from somebody who runs suicides all the time, I can see myself using him. Now, the last time I used him outside of Arena was in uh, Alliance Quest. And I've done a video on Guardian before. But I've used him in Alliance Quest uh, during uh, one of the epic modifiers. I forget what it's called right now. Um, was it Cascading Failure? I think it is. But every time you crit, you get a debuff on you and you don't want to crit too many times in a row. So it's really bad for like Corvus. But for him, it's perfect because he doesn't crit. All right, so in a minute, we're going to go into Realm of Legends and you're going to get to see a little gameplay on Guardian. All right, let's head on into Realm of Legends and fight a little bit of Winter Soldier. But first, let me show you the synergies that I'm going in here with. So Guardian has a synergy with himself and all champions on the team, except for Guardian, gain block proficiency. So he's great to bring on the team, even if you're not planning on using him to fight. But he's actually pretty good uh, as a fighter as well. All right. Uh, we've got this one here. Well-timed blocks inflict a shock debuff. So you're going to see that because I'm going to be uh, parrying uh, Winter Soldier. That's what well-timed blocks mean. Uh, then you've got this one here uh, with Mole Man. Each time Guardian has zero force field charges and gains a charge, he'll gain an additional one so he can build them up uh, faster. Uh, this one here just more armor rating, and this one here, a higher perfect block chance. And I wanted to go in with these particulars, uh, uh, particular champions because I could see myself going in with a team like this. These are good champions, okay? Um, I love it when the synergies are with champions that are pretty good. Sasquatch is pretty good. Uh, Mole Man, you already know, I took him to rank three. Awesome. Red Hulk, a beast, okay? And Colossus, you guys already know. All right. So let's go in. Now, one thing about Guardian, he does not crit. So that's good for when you're fighting somebody uh, that you don't want to crit against. 
Now, one thing that I remember, because uh, I have taken up my five star. I've taken the five star up to uh, rank five, SIG 200. And he is awesome. Now, one thing that I, I kind of don't like about Guardian is that to get that real nasty damage out of his special two, you need to really build up your uh, charges. And in order to do that, if I remember correctly, uh, you need to fire off a few special threes. Okay, and then you get some uh, permanent charges, I believe. And the more you get, the harder his special two will hit. Now, this Guardian is my six star, and he's only, uh, I think he's sig 40 now. All right, see that uh, yellow icon? He's got nine of these charges right now. And you can see every time oh, I got hit there, but every time I parry him, he's getting shocks on him. And those are doing some damage. Okay. So now I've got eight permanent of these until I fire off that special two. So I'm going back up to a special three. Firing off another special three. And I've seen folks make videos where you see this massive special two damage but it's because they were doing this they were building up uh those charges see all those perfect blocks so now he's got 15 of those charges but look at his health he's very tanky very very tanky i'm running suicides all right so Right now, what I'm doing, and you see he gets power drained every once in a while, um, Winter Soldier does. But all I'm doing right here is just building up these uh, charges. But he's almost half dead at this point. Okay, so I'm going to fire up one more and then fire off a special two. And then uh, we'll see how much damage that does. But he's actually uh, pretty good. He's pretty good. He's he's underrated, I feel. Um, you don't see him get used a lot. But in a lot of situations, he's actually really good. All right, so let's get to that special uh, two. We've got uh, 14, boom. And then look at the damage, oh my goodness. That is just wicked. All right, that is wicked. So he's not a big giant, you know, damage machine, but he can put it down. He can put it down. Now, where I would more than likely use him um he's great against any champion that you don't want to crit against so like for example scarlet witch scarlet witch every time you crit against her there's a chance that you'll both get power drain well you don't have to worry about that don't have to worry about that um if you're in alliance quest and you're doing one of the epic modifiers uh, where every time you crit, you get a debuff placed on you and it's really annoying. You can use him. Don't have to worry about that. Okay. So he has a lot of uses, a lot of uses. Um, he's very tanky. Um, I believe he has uh, really high energy resistance as well. You can see uh, that, you know, I didn't fire off, but like one special in any case, but even though I'm running suicides, he's not losing a ton of uh, health. You can see almost all the health he actually did lose was because of that liquid courage. Almost all of it was because of liquid courage, even though I got hit, okay? So you can judge for yourself how useful uh, he is, but I think he's actually underrated. I think he's actually much better than a lot of people think. 
uh, the five star, when I really get going with that five star, it's crazy. It's, it's insane. Uh, you don't see me using him all that often because I have other champions that um, I use in most situations, but I like having him in my toolkit. He is actually really, really good. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. What do you think about Guardian? Do you think he's underrated? You know, where do you use him or do you use him? You know, take care. And you all... Have a blessed day.